Okay, folks, um, I'm back again with another story here, uh, and this is, this is a follow-up on a story that I did the other day about a uh, college student, Alexis Crawford, 21-year-old uh, college student from Clark, Clark Atlanta University, and uh, I just got a report that they found her, uh, found her dead. Uh, so the story is, a Clark University student who was found dead in a park had filed a police report describing unwanted kissing and touching days before she went missing, authorities said. The man she filed a report against is now one of two people accused of the murder. Alexis Crawford, 21 years old, vanished from her off-campus apartment more uh, than a week ago and was found dead in a park in a nearby DeKalb County on Friday. Her death was the result of asphyxiation. Uh, the Atlanta Police Department said Saturday in a news release that cited the medical ex examiner's office. Police identified the suspect as Jordan Jones and uh, Baron, Baron Brantley, both 21 years old. One of the two suspects led investigators to where her body was found, Police Chief Erica Shields told reporters. While a motive was, has not been clearly established, the department did take the police report from Alexis Crawford's around October 27th, and this is a few days prior to her being reported missing, Shield said. In this report, Alexis described unwanted kissing and touching from Baron Brantley. Jones is the, vic is the victim's roommate and friend, police said. Brantley is the boyfriend of Jones. Brantley was booked into the Fulton County Jail in Atlanta on Friday and is accused of, of murder along with three probation violations and hindering persons making the emergency telephone call according, according to information from the Fulton County Jail. He has been booked into that jail five times in the past two years. Jones was booked Saturday and faced a major uh, murder charge in according, according to jail records. Crawford's roommate told police she saw uh, saw Crawf uh, saw her around midnight, November first, before going to bed. She was not in the apartment the next morning when the roommate left for class, and the front door was locked uh, with a deadbolt. The roommate told police Crawford's iPhone ID and de debit card were missing from the apartment. Her phone charger and keys were found inside uh, were finally inside the apartment on the end of the table by the couch. Her sister told police they last spoke about eight o'clock on October 30th when Crawford asked her sister what uh, she planned to do over the weekend. Her sister uh, said she wasn't doing anything and Crawford stopped responding to texts after that. Her family is devastated. Uh, who, uh, Hutchins spoke with her parents after hearing about her death and, and says they are grieving. Alexis's mother was literally unable to speak. All that she could do was listen as I tried to console her and comfort her. If they wanted to take somebody's life, they could have taken mine. They didn't have to kill my baby. They didn't have to kill her. Uh, in the heartbreak, the family is thankful for the support from the local community as well as from people all over the country, she said. Shields extended her condolences to the family and says she wishes things turn, had turned out differently. The case has come to uh, one of the saddest conclusions possible and has, uh, has been absolutely heartbreaking. So this is uh, you know, a follow-up, and I just did this story the other day pertaining to uh, black women and black, and black girls that have been coming up missing, that's been missing here. And a lot of times they don't get any coverage, any news coverage, you know, when something happens to them. So, you know, we uh, as a community have to really wake up and think about what's going on and we have to uh, try to do what we can to protect the uh, women and the uh, girls in our community because, you know, they, you know, if they can't turn to us, as far as black men, if they can't turn to us for protection, who can they turn to? So, you know, it's time to step up to the plate and uh, do as much as you can to protect these women and to protect these girls from harm.
So, uh, 